1976, the town of Seveso, Italy, suffered a toxic chemical disaster that is often overshadowed by other industrial accidents but had far-reaching consequences. On July the 10th, at a small chemical manufacturing plant near the town, a safety valve failed during routine operations, releasing a massive cloud of dioxin, one of the most toxic chemicals known to man. The plant, operated by ICMESA, was producing trichlorophenol, a key ingredient in herbicides and disinfectants. During routine maintenance, a reactor overheated, leading to a runaway chemical reaction. As pressure built inside the reactor, an emergency safety valve opened, releasing an estimated 2 kilograms of dioxin, or TCDD, into the atmosphere. Dioxin is an incredibly potent compound, capable of causing harm at concentrations as low as parts per billion, making this release a catastrophic event for the local population. Initially, the plant's operators downplayed the severity of the incident. Authorities were not immediately informed of the scale or nature of the chemical release, which delayed evacuation and containment efforts. Within days, locals began noticing alarming signs. Vegetation withered, birds fell from the sky, and small animals such as rabbits and chickens died en masse. Residents exposed to the dioxin experienced severe skin lesions called chloracin, as well as nausea, headaches, and eye irritation. Over time, studies revealed that the dioxin contamination posed long-term risks of cancer, immune system disorders, and reproductive issues, particularly among children and pregnant women who were most vulnerable to its effects. The aftermath of the Cerveso disaster was a turning point in industrial safety and environmental regulation. More than 80,000 animals were slaughtered to prevent the spread of contamination through the food chain and over 600 people were forcibly evacuated. The contaminated soil was stripped and stored in sealed containers, and the affected area was cordoned off for years. Investigations revealed that cost-cutting measures and inadequate safety protocols at ICMISA contributed to the accident. The public outcry led to the creation of the Seviso Directive in 1982 a European Union regulation mandating strict controls on the storage and handling of hazardous substances. The incident remains a sobering reminder of the human and environmental costs of industrial negligence.